Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be taking you guys on a little trip. A shopping trip, to be exact. And we're doing this because I need to find a few more decorative pieces for my client's Airbnb. We are in the process of installation and there were a couple of items that were not able to make it to Jamaica in time. So here we are at Active Home Center to start. And we are actually looking for some table lamps, two bathroom mirrors, a standing floor mirror, art pieces, and any other decorative objects that would tie really well into the space. As soon as we walk in, we found a table lamp and it was perfect. The right size, the right price. I believe this was 9,500 plus tax and that's per lamp. So we ended up buying three of those Right, so we are pretty much just discussing how perfect this lamp is for the bedrooms. And yeah, we are discussing our next move. And I have to say, we have been at Active Home Center for maybe two minutes. And already we have an employee coming to assist us, just checking in to see if we're all good. And we're, you know, telling her this is what we want to take thus far. And she's going to take the item number and have it ready for us to cash out. So we're pretty much just browsing through the entire store, seeing all of what they have to offer, hoping that we can get all of the shopping done in one place. However, that ended up not being the case. We did actually have to find other items elsewhere. And funny enough, I actually did end up coming back here the following day. And that's because there was a particular piece that I had seen that I just could not get off my mind. I went to bed thinking about it. I woke up thinking about it and so I felt strongly that yeah we we have to incorporate this particular piece into the space and you guys will see where it is that it will be placed in the next video As I said before, we needed to check out a few other places because we were not able to find everything that we needed at Active Home Center. So here we are at LPSR and they had a wide variety of decorative pieces. However, we were not able to find anything that worked for the space style-wise as well as price-wise. Nonetheless, LPSR has a wide variety, like I said before, of furniture, decorative pieces, they have rugs, they have an entire fabric section and that's just the upstairs part of the building. Downstairs has so many other things. So after unfortunately coming up short at LPSR, we decided to head down to Ashley Home Furniture where, you know, there are some fond memories here. I actually participated in their decorators challenge last year and won so yeah it was nice to be back here again walking through the entire store bringing back all those fond memories and you can actually relive some of those memories with me by watching the video of the challenge 
that I made a couple of months back by clicking on the link in the upper right hand corner of this video. Now let's get back to our mission. Unfortunately, we didn't find anything in here either that would work really well for the space. So we kept it moving and that was actually it for today. We picked up right where we left off the next day and we started off our day at Spaces Jamaica. Now this is my first time coming into the store and I have to say I was pleasantly surprised. They have a lot of really cute pieces a lot of trendy and stylish decor and furniture but sadly we didn't find anything here in this store so we decided to make our way to the next destination which happens to be Santana and let me tell you at this point I felt like I was grasping at straws I was feeling a little bit desperate but let me tell you when I say I was thrilled Fontana actually came through to save the day they they came in with a win first things first this vase took that and then we found these lovely decorative branches and the bathroom mirror that i needed and these two round decorative mirrors are gonna be on the living room wall so yeah on everything here at Fontana. So that's a wrap on the shopping portion of this video. I am gonna show you guys some video clips of the before and sort of the in-between process. As you can see, everything here is in disarray, but we are gonna completely transform the space and you'll see all of that in the next video. So stay tuned for that. And as always, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. And before we go, you can actually see what you can look forward to in the next video.